What's up everybody, this is Barbecue Disc Golf and today we are at Enterprise at the Landing Zone, the course where we will be hosting um, a B tier in two weeks. Today we're playing Blues, there is quite a bit of wind, it's nice outside, it's about 60 but it is breezy, about 10-15 miles per hour winds. I will include all of the details in the videos or whenever we throw off and uh, enjoy it's probably going to be a voiceover thank you so hole one 350 feet a little bit uphill and there is a low ceiling at this point i didn't know the volume is going to be much better so this is the only clip without anything like not me speaking so we'll throw a wrath it's going to be flat on the right side of the basket and there is a right to left headwind and uh, this is how it ended up. We'll do two of the first. Throw a felon. So I am doing a little tournament prep, so don't mind me, I will be throwing two to three discs. I'll try to talk about all of them, disc choice and why I threw it. Uh, there's a lot of wind today, so a lot of overstable discs will be flying today. Uh, it is right to left on this hole. That's why you saw both of those overstable discs kind of hold more than I wanted them to. but. That's why I chose them. Alrighty, let's go make. So this is where Wrath ended up, and I don't think we'll be making a lot of putts because Felon is literally under the basket. Let's step it in, and we're starting with the birdie. So hole two, 250 feet uphill. It is uphill 27 feet. Um, I usually go with something a little like Envy. And that's what we're going to throw right now. And maybe we'll, for the second throw, we'll disc up to Hex. It is a wild tailwind right now. So I'm going to aim about right there on the flat line and let that tailwind push it. About 15 feet, uh, let's throw a hex, and I have two hexes, but I'll... Alrighty, the wind is down, uh, it is about 350, we're gonna go with wrath and hang it out approximately to that side let the disc work back in the basket is on the left side you probably won't be able to see it but this is how the hole looks the basket is stacked around right there and there's a really big slope going to the left alrighty this should be a good angle flat work the left looks perfect we should be able to tap it in throwing feels really good today we're on hole three and I didn't really have to make any putts today yet um, it is a little scary because I don't feel warmed up for putting at all on the last hole it was a lot of nerves so uh, we'll see how we can keep that Birdie streak of life, I guess. Okay, let's go see where that wrath is. So not a tap in. It's about 20 footer, 25 footer uphill. Set you guys down right here. And uh, I'll go try to make that putt. Whip it. Oh, come on, girl. Oh, it's 
So another short technical hole. This is 217 feet. Uphill 20 feet. We're going with neutron proxy. I'm gonna just try to hit it flat and then on the second try we'll do something different. Uh, and we square the tree. Alright. So this is what I just got. Wombat 3. And I'm gonna try to do the same thing, just lean off of it a little bit. And that's parked. That might be the play. So we don't have to muscle it in and just play a nice soft flat release with the mid-range. I don't know. I think you should be able to see it still. We're gonna give it a soft bid because there's nothing behind the basket. Cage. Good bit. Okay, I'm not sure you'll be able to see this basket. It's right there. It is 198 feet, bar three. I cannot film proper shot for you because there's a slow behind the basket, but I'm going with my jokery and I'm gonna try to pull it flat and for the disc on itself work the to the left. This is as good as it gets. And my favorite shot on this If home. you got this far in the video, um, thank you for watching, first of all. Let me know what kind of content you would like to see. Uh, and um, keep being you, keep being awesome. Thank you. So we got this 10 footer to the basket. Hopefully I don't miss this one. I do feel a little nervous for some reason. But we're good. We're in. So, this is a separator hole. It is uh, 316 feet. It is straight and to the right. I'm going to show you two plays. I'm going to play forehand and backhand. So, we're going to play forehand solo. stops by those trees. We're gonna play one bob three flat release and try to work it to the right. That was beautiful as well. So most likely backhand. Uh, let's go see where they ended up. <sighs> so this is the look that we got for the felon. I prefer the backhand here. This is how we do it! <laughs> Alpaca! And this is our second drive. Alright, hole seven. Uh, it's up and to the to the left. I'm gonna try to get you guys a good view. But I prefer to throw Toro here. Um, Put it flat and just make it work to the basket. Let's see how that plays out for us today. I think it'll be another 20, 25 footer, maybe 30 footer. Well, just a little wide, maybe 30, maybe 35. I'll pack up. On the roll today our first water hole it is absolutely gorgeous 
305 feet, 26 feet down. The basket tucked to the right, about right there. I don't know if you can see it, but I'll try to zoom in on the video if possible. Anthropraxis. Here, we're gonna go. Let's try this angle. I think that should be about right. Okay, we're gonna throw it soft and let it work. That's about 40 feet. That was not a Alrighty, hole nine, 203 feet straight up. Uh, I'm gonna go with jokery. There's a massive tail window. So this is just to give you an idea how the putt from here looks. If you go long, we'll lay up the first one and run the second one. Alright. Even I ran it and it was terrible. You can still see that you'll be punished severely <laughs> if you go long on this hole. So we tap in our par, take an easy throw. Uh, I think that's all the stuff that my phone can process. So we're gonna end front nine here and we'll start with the back nine in just a second. Um, I'll upload the videos back to back so you have the full 18 and preview of the course. Uh, if you enjoyed it, please subscribe, give me thumbs up, share with your friends. If anybody playing on this tournament, let them know, send them this video, how to play this course, because I think we did pretty dang good job. And on to the back nine. Bye.